Facebook page because we're going to stream live right now so you can check out the upcoming interview. You can see Henry. Henry is uh, kind of in a little class. He's learning how to be a talk show host. It's his dream to be a talk show host. And uh, we want to thank the people from Dr. Phillips yeah. for sending Henry here. They have some amazing classes, uh, and, and you got to check it out. Go to the website. It's drphillipscenter.org backslash school of hearts and you can see all the fantastic classes like the sensory friendly acting class for individuals with autism uh and uh, this week uh henry uh sports wars play put on the theater week camp so there's a theater week camp a partnership with oca and dr phillips center now henry so far in your little class here with us and turn his mic on real quick if you don't mind uh with uh with uh, your class you've learned a lot of different things about being a talk show host uh, one of them is okay. First off, uh, you have to have a catchphrase. What is your What is your catch, catchphrase again? I'm thinking about me. Okay, I'm thinking about me. I, I thought it was. It's all about me. It switches from time to time. Don't tell an artist what his work oh, is. Yes. I'm just asking. Yeah. Okay, oh, you're thinking about me. Okay, you're supposed and, to paint this. And then, yeah. <laughs> and then what else? What else have you learned here at uh, in, in your class to be a talk show host? My talk show host is talking about me. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. That's good. That's, that's pretty, pretty much what. That's, that's just what Russ does, does too. <laughs> right. Exactly. Uh, and then you learn how to interview people, and you've been doing very well. But what we've been doing is we've kind of been giving you the person, so you know who to to interview. Uh, but this is going to be a little bit of a different thing. Okay. So you don't even know who you're going to talk to, and I'm going to give you this card and let you enter. We didn't even know this person was going to be here today. Happened to me in the hallway, and uh, and so sometimes this will happen. There'll be a celebrity here, and they'll say, Russ, there's somebody here. You got to enter. Him, and I might not know anything about him, but I have to make up questions on the fly. So that's going to be your job right now. I'll let you go ahead and uh, introduce our, our next surprise guest. We have have our, our very, very special guest. It's a swap girl. Oh, Yay! Wow, what a surprise. Swap girl. What a surprise. Wow. Out of here. Oh, and you're going to do an in-depth like interview. That? Yeah, okay. Right there, girl. Right there, swamp girl. Wow. Uh, swamp girl, this is, uh, this is Henry. Hey, Henry. Hi. How are you? Same I'm voice. doing good. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. So what, what questions do you have for? So, you know, you are a big star on radio. What is your catchphrase? Oh, good question. Yeah, what's your catchphrase? Um, I don't know. I don't have one, I don't think. There you go. Yeah. So why do you have so many tattoos? <laughs> Um, because I like tattoos. I think they make people happy when they see them, and all my tattoos are super happy. Can you sing? Can you talk? I'm a really. I'm oh a, my god! <laughs> wrong question. Wrong question. <laughs> Can you sing? Can you talk? I'm a really good singer. I actually have two CDs, and uh, they were like number one selling CDs when I released them. And I've sold out a bunch of concerts: Hard Rock Live, the Plaza Resort and Spa in Daytona Beach. So yeah, I can sing and talk. Do you want to ask her to sing for you? Uh, Henry? No. <laughs> what? Why don't you want me to sing for you, Henry? No. Oh, my God. How are you not letting me share my talents with you? No, I'm not. <laughs> no. The <laughs> man knows how to run his own talk show. Why does he want to kick my ass? Right. No. <laughs> Next question, Henry. Why do you smell like smoke? <laughs> oh, because I smoke Because uh, I smoke, um, sometimes I smoke one of those vape things. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what else you got? And what else You're doing do great, you Henry. I'm hey, sorry? Did you take a shower? Or a bath? <laughs> did I take a shower or a bath? Yeah. I took no shower or a bath today. Yesterday I did. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> so, Savannah, are those tattoos or just extremely colorful ringworm? <laughs> oh, man. I don't have ringworm but i do have a tick head embedded in my back <laughs> do you want to see that yeah. yep yeah. <laughs> i can show it to you really it's there i thought i'd cut it out with my knife but it's still there yeah of course <laughs> <laughs> the old tick head embedded yes. in my back yes. you're, doing, you're, you're doing great you're doing great henry just keep on yeah. with your question the first thing that pops to your mind you know that you want to Let ask her just ask her anything yeah and ask her what do you want to say about um, I, you know what I do when I, when I'm not here in the studio, I work with alligators and crocodiles. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>
Uh, crocodiles. I, <laughs> and why? That's why? Good, and why is a good question. Well, I think they're really important to the environment and they're really important to the world, actually. The Everglades were carved out by alligators trying to get into different places, and that's why all those different uh, waterways are there. Did you know that? Yeah, I think so. <laughs> yeah, this day one stuff, Savannah. Sorry, <laughs> Henry. Henry, you're doing great. Now, yeah. what you want to do is keep you know, keep her attention and keep asking her questions. That's and keep, the hard part. Keep her involved <laughs> and and uh, be inquisitive. Okay, you're doing great. Keep going. Yeah. And why do you want to do something about your favorite favorite vacation on the show? Oh, favorite vacation. My oh. favorite vacation I ever have been on. I went to Cuba. Not uh, not like a month ago. Cuba? I went, <laughs> I went all the way to Cuba, yeah, and I worked with Cuban crocodiles in Cuba, and I'm going back again. You're going to go back again? Yeah. She's building a raft right now. Yep. <laughs> yep. <laughs> <laughs> and also on the invitation to talk about uh, the real funny dude is to talk about a little bit invitation. Yeah. But, you know, sometimes it just really recognize the really funny about the um, – even that at, at even sports wars like OCA Theater Week at camp. Yeah, have you ever taken camp? Is what he's asking because he's an OCA camp. Oh, okay. Yeah, I've been to camp a bunch of times. Camp's where you get ticks. <laughs> <laughs> Tick camp. Yes, as long as you don't sing and you don't talk. <laughs> Was that a question? I don't think More that was a statement. I don't think it was a question, Henry. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Form them as questions probably might work better. Was, that was a yeah. yeah. That was like a statement. Yeah, yeah. You're doing great though, Henry. This is the, I gotta tell you for an advanced class and answering questions, asking questions at the last minute, you're doing perfect. Uh, the guest seems to be happy. That's good. Uh, go ahead. You got any more questions for the interview? And how can I become um, famous, famous like you? Oh, oh whoa, that's yeah. really hard. It depends on how poor you want to get. Yeah. yeah. Did you say um, unfamous? <laughs> no, unfamous no, like Dirty you? Jam. He said famous, not oh. for you, for me. Sorry. Um, I think what you have to do is you just have to be yourself. And if you're always yourself and you're always true to what you believe in your heart, people will love you because they know that you're real. Yeah, I'm good. <laughs> yeah, I'm good. <laughs> yeah, I'm good. <laughs> Sounds like a lot of work, too, man. I'm yeah, like, yeah. It really does. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, it's cumbersome, almost. God, Henry, you couldn't be doing any better, buddy. Good job. Thanks. <laughs> yeah. And say, I saw you holding a gator. Are you boobs real? <laughs> <laughs> Question. That's, a great, that's a great question. Henry. I'm gonna I'm gonna take that question and I'm gonna I'm gonna send you to uh, realradio.fm. Is that what it is? Yep. And if you want to go, you can have a look and you can figure that out for yourself. <laughs> I'm not gonna answer that question. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. Sorry, Henry. I can't answer that for you. That's okay. <laughs> Now, Henry, whenever you, you can keep asking questions, yeah. or if you feel like you're yeah, getting a little, job. a little bored with your, 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 your guest, then you can wrap it up in whatever way you want to. Uh, it's totally up to you. If you want to keep going, you can. If you're feeling like, eh, I've done enough, then you can wrap it up. It's, you're, you're the talk show host, whatever you want. Yeah, but I had to say to you, I just really recognize in front of you, you just call me a little bit sure, but, it, but in this case, is Thursday at Theater Week Camp, and Mom will pick you up. <laughs> <laughs> Are you, oh, asking, okay. are, you, are you asking her out on a date? Are you oh. asking her for a date? Yeah. <laughs> and Friday, right. and Friday, Friday, Mom and me and take you, Mom and me are going to take you to the Dr. Phillips Center for performing arts. Really? And see Sports Wars. I like yeah. the way you went and, to the plug. We'll the exactly. audience. And then after Sports Wars, Mom, Mom, will, Mom will go home to Mimi and Granddad's. You, oh. you, you must be working at you Night with Tim Howell to plug already? because you are plugging very well. That's yeah. a radio profession. I, radio I, think, profession. I think you should take me for food before I meet your family. Yeah. Oh, no. Yeah. And oh, what yeah. he's talking about is Sports Wars, and you play it out at Theater Week Camp, a partnership with OCA, and that's why they're here today. Yeah. The Dr. Phillips Center for... Florida Hospital School of the Arts. Henry, you are amazing. Henry, you're doing a great job. Henry. Yeah, you're awesome, so Henry. Thanks for being here. I'm Henry. I'm thinking about me. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Henry, so if you were going to take Swamp Girl to, yeah. to dinner, like what restaurant would you want to go to? And she's going to McDonald's. Yes. <laughs> Henry, Henry, you just should meet her Henry, there. <laughs> you gotta pick somebody you gotta pick someplace different. Uh, yeah, but buy her loaf of bread before you go there. <laughs> yeah. And I'm going to talk about something different today. Uh, I say take her to Publix and get a sub. Yeah, yeah Publix sub. There we go. <laughs> so and, and yeah, I give myself thank you. Oh, yes, wow. you should. And next week, 
And next week is the final radio show. Oh, uh, is it? It's next week is the final. Oh, now, no. I gotta, now I got to tell you, uh, I happened to hear, you know, overheard your mom talking. Is is today your mom's birthday? Yeah. Uh, it's mom's birthday. Oh, happy, birthday. Oh, happy birthday! Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Feliz cumpleaños! Oh. No! What did you oh, say you to her? Oh, you speak Spanish? Yeah. Oh, that just did it. That just did it. Spanish like. Uh-oh. You speak Spanish? <laughs> yeah, yeah. learning Spanish. So you should come to Cuba with me. That way you can translate for me. Hey, I said my first words. <laughs> <laughs> hey, are you gonna do anything special for your mom's birthday? Yeah, but but you know I'm talking about my card. Oh, you made a card? A, what kind of card? Oh, you made a, a birthday Pretty card. Mom? Oh, that's cool. Oh. Uh, a present card? Yeah. Mm-hmm. That's and, just... and even says, I love you. Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. oh that's sweetheart. so sweet. That's that's sweet. sweet. I make Russ a card that says, I love you every morning, but yeah. I'm just too embarrassed to give it to him. I got a stack. <laughs> you know? can, can I ask you a question? If you were to take Savannah out to dinner, what kind of food would you buy her? French fries. <laughs> I, I like French fries. French fries are good. French, yeah, I think so. French fries are, French fries are awesome. Hey, uh, you okay? That's okay. Uh, Thank you. You all right there? Okay. It's Og Henry. You're doing he's, a great job. He's a, he's oh, yeah, man, you had a good job. Yeah, he's been amazing. And the reason he's been amazing is because of the amazing partnership that we have. Uh, Henry's mother is here. And uh, he's been kicking butt. If you want to check this out, it's the Dr. Phillips Florida Hospital School of the Arts. Go to drphillipscenter.org backslash school of hearts or call them 407-455-5551. You can see the amazing Henry do his thing. Henry, yes. What a big radio uh, host does right now. Thank you. If you're done, you throw off your headphones and you storm out of the room like I just did it. You you just got to go. Amazing. All right. You did a great job, buddy. Thank you. And I'll be back next week. Nice. Yeah. 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 I'll be back phrase. next week at the radio station. And what's your catchphrase? Yeah. I'm thinking about me. All right, good job, buddy. You did a great job. Uh, Savannah, I'm sorry about the last minute uh, you know, interview thing. But, uh, oh, but that was fun. It was kind of a class for Henry. because I need to talk to you, though, after this is over. Oh, why? Why? Because you're making people think I'm dumb. <laughs> me? I, yeah, we should have a conversation about that, but not in front of Henry because I like him and I don't want to um, talk like that in front of Henry. <laughs> I'm making people think you're stupid. <laughs> you? You're, you're, you're blaming that on me. You're putting sound effects on my voice when I come into the show, uh-huh. and it makes me people think I'm stupid. I'm tired of getting emails about it. So, <laughs> so people have sent you email saying that you sound stupid. Yeah. And, and you think that's my fault. I know it's your fault. <laughs> it's a new it's a new device I got. It's called auto stoop. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's like something, you, some kind of thing you put on the microphone. It makes me sound like I'm stupid when I talk. Uh-huh. 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 Uh, do you have any, any proof to anyone that you, uh, I you're, think it's just you're not got, stupid? I, I just don't. It's the on button, right? Yeah. <laughs> no, it's not, Dirty Jim. I need to be on the other side well, so I can see Dirty Jim's well, face. Well, let me I ask, disagree. Uh, let me ask Dirty Jim a question. I mean, you get the texting service. Uh, uh, have you ever had one person text in that Savannah's <laughs> stupid? Has that ever happened? Mm-mm, no. <laughs> Thanks, Dirty Jim. Everybody says she's awesome. See? So there you go. Nobody thinks you're stupid. That's not what they say when they write me messages. Uh, what's Okay, what's the last message that you got? They say, why do you talk so stupid? Why do you sound so dumb? Why don't you say some smart stuff? Oh, uh, yeah, we tried that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, say, say something smart then. Uh, okay, tell me, tell me a little bit about uh, air traffic control. That's the smartest thing Wait, you Wait, I wasn't ready yet. Oh, what do you mean? Um, well, I mean, I could, but uh, I, I don't, uh, yeah, I am i can't do it right now. Oh, well, then, okay, that's my fault that you sound stupid. No, it's not. <laughs> well, it's your fault I sound stupid, but it's not your fault that I can't think of air traffic control right now. You don't remember but, one, one, yeah, one word? Yeah, I remember, like, how to tell people to land and stuff like that. Of right. course I remember how to do that. Tell Jeff how, how to land. Um. <laughs> oh, I know how to land on that. <laughs> land, <laughs> land now. Yeah. Over. <laughs> So, like, if someone was coming in, then I would say, like, Phoenix 3-5 at midfield, break left, runway 2-4, report turning base. And then they would talk back to me. Oh, that sounds smart. And then smart. I would say, Phoenix 2-5, cleared land, runway 2-4, uh, wind, calm, altimeter, 2992, things like that. Wow. But it's not stuff I use in my day-to-day life. But either way, you're making me sound stupid. And off the top of your head like yeah. that. That was amazing. Yeah. <laughs> Man. This is Phoenix 2-5, requesting a flyby. <laughs> 
No flybys. Okay, so uh, you weren't supposed to come in here today, but you were in the area because I, get, I think you had something going on with a, a gator. You went to the yes, gator Yesterday place. I went to Jungle Adventures, and I filmed some stuff for an ABC television show, and it was I was outside, and thank you so much, Kobe, for your letting me go and do that. What got to and <laughs> and he was actually there. Like That's I called okay, in dog. yesterday. I, uh-huh. I called in yesterday, and then I talked about going there. But I was just going to stand outside to film the thing because I want to be in front of the big gator. Of course. And then um, he was there when I got there. The owner. Yeah. The guy that's owner who's wanting to sell it. Yeah. And he knows you're wanting to buy it. Yeah. Now is it is it advantageous? Like you guys uh, against each other? Or no, 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 he... no. Like we're a team. Like yeah. he was really cool. He was like, just tell me what you need. Hold on, there. Are you sure it's not advantageable? Advantageable. What's that word? <laughs> Did uh, I say that? I know. There was a word I was trying to say, and it didn't come out right. Yeah. <laughs> Advertational. Advers- ad- like adversaries, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> no, we're we're on the same team. Like, he really likes what I'm doing, and, I'm and that's stop, what he said. He I'm going to stop making you sound stupid. He said, uh, he said, uh, <laughs> Savannah. Do, can you do it, Carlos? Oh, yes, Savannah, you are beautiful. I like your tattoos. I want you to hold my gator right now in my pants. <laughs> Hold this gator sock in my pants. He didn't Hold say that. Hold the gator that. sock in what my nation- pants and you dance. What nationality is he? I don't know. He's, uh, What's his name? Kobe. Oh. <laughs> it's I actually know. Kobe Bryant. He's, he's, probably, <laughs> he's probably Irish then. No, yeah. his last name is Kagan. So he, what kind of last name is that? that? Yeah. Sounds Irish. It's Kobe Kagan here he, looking for some he, weapons. No, so we, can, we can teach this partisans what's what. You know? <laughs> he looked like his ethnicity may have been uh, Middle Eastern. Can I? Maybe yeah. that. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Can I pet your bearded dragon? If <laughs> <laughs> you do want to go in here, you could use bathroom. You could look at me naked. It's fine. Yeah. Whatever you want to do. These gators are beautiful. You could ride the gator. You could be with me. It doesn't so matter. I, I thought you were going to one of the clients today. I am. Go I called them like three times. And you're going to go catch, like, uh, gators or raccoons or something? What I'm going to go catch a wild hog and maybe move a nuisance gator. You're going to catch a wild hog. Now, yeah. you know those are very, very dangerous. To who? To Is the it, person trying to catch as it. As much as I love hold, bacon, they're not dangerous. Hold on for a second. Isn't Catch a Wild Hog your dating app? <laughs> 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 so we're You're being really mean today, Dirty Jim. Yes, you need to lay off of Dirty Jim. I come yes. after the other oh, yeah. I'll, I'll I'll bomb on you. I'm Swipe, making her sound hey. stupid. You're being mean. Swipe broke. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what that means. Uh, it's, it's a I, beautiful joke. Just keep on going. Pretend like you got the joke and keep on going. Uh, I've okay. been doing Is that for what you do? Years, yeah. All right. The pro to your left got it. That's <laughs> so listen, so, so so somebody is actually has a wild hog in an area and you're you were supposed to go catch that. Yeah. Hog? Is it Catch like a, it. Na- a neighborhood or? No, it's not a neighborhood. It's a backyard, and it, but it's like a big backyard because you know there's lots of land in Florida. So I'm supposed to go catch a hog. So somebody has a, so, a big backyard uh-huh. and there's a hog in it, and and, and they want this company. You know, to come like catch- out at TM Ranch, right? How yeah. that's their yard, but it's gigantic. Right. And there's oh, hogs 13, in it. And, yeah. Thirteen thousand acres. So yeah. Yeah. Acreage. Yeah. Do they want you to stand on one end and scare it into the net? <laughs> 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 Get out of here, hogs! You too wild. But I'm the wildest bitch this land ever seen. Damn. Rawr. She looks hungry. <laughs> no, they just want me to catch it. Mm-hmm. I don't know if you catch it with a knife or not, or if you just jump on it. That's I, killing. I, I, Savannah, I, that's not catching. That's killing. Yeah. <laughs> I had a buddy of mine that ju- jumped off his horse with a little knife and jumped on a wild uh, like what was it? It was like a pig, probably. I wouldn't say wild hog. Yeah. It was a pig and stabbed it. Oh, that's horrible. And they're they're really, really, really mean. Dude. I know. Yeah, yeah. They're... If I kill it, I'm gonna bring it to Dirty Jim's house for yeah, we'll cooking. Dr- we'll dress that bitch up and roast it. Yeah, yeah. Mm. that would be good, huh? Uh, that'd be great. Yeah. Uh, so okay, you <laughs> sound like Henry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right, yeah. I'll put it on my electric grill. <laughs> and, and then, uh, when are you going to raise all this money to go back to Cuba? Because I know you already bought your your plane ticket yeah. and you're what, going back to Cuba. What is the targeted amount, by the way? I mean, and I'm being dead serious. Uh, How much money do you need to take down there for a week to like live? Now, I mean, not even like just to be able to eat. I think I could do it probably for five hundred dollars. <laughs> Check I think. out. How many times did she say that? You're, 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 so you're only going to stay an hour? No, yeah. no, no. Listen, listen. So I, I have friends down there now, and they want to let me stay at their house. But I think it's illegal for them to let me stay at their house. So I don't want to get them in trouble. Illegal? Why would it be illegal? Because they have weird rules about tourists in Cuba. Like you can't, like, if it's a tourist hotel, mm-hmm. you can't, like. Meet people there, become friends, and then go to the no, hotel with them. You yeah. can, uh, what's it, you know, con- your con- it, yeah. It's a communist country still. I mean, it's still holding strong to communism, but, you know. But they want that money. They want that yeah. money. Yeah, yeah man. Come change. on, come on so, down. It's so changing. they said I could stay at their house. My friend Lourdes said I can stay at her house, but I hate to stay at her house and eat up her food. Yeah, I think sure. she said stay away from my Not house yeah. in Spanish. No, they email me every day, these yeah. long emails, and they're all in Spanish, and I don't know what it says, so I put it in a translator, yeah. and it's so it's like half right, half wrong, yeah. you know? Right. Mm-hmm. But I try to make the best of what I can figure out. Either way, I have to go there. I like the 
like after the 20th of August so I can hatch out those crocodile babies. Make sure you bring gifts for Lourdes, her family, and for the secret police that are going to yes. be like yeah. listening into all the phone the calls minders, as well. The minders, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Now, let me ask a question. When you're down there, I, I mean, I, I guess they get some shows on there. Uh, American TV? Show, yeah, not a lot. Listen, novellas. Oh, yeah, is it? Everybody watches their novellas. When it's novella time, there are no people oh, on the really? street. Yeah, it's yeah. yeah. So nobody asks you if you're Both. a bounty hunter and, and or anything. Just real quick. <laughs> <laughs> a bounty hunter. Novella. Oh, if I'm Doug the bounty hunter? Yeah. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> Doug the bounty Um A novella is basically like a soap opera? A novella, yeah. yes. Okay, gotcha. Dos mujeres, un, un camino. camino. <laughs> Dos we mujeres, un camino. We My favorite is on Revolution. Netflix. It's uh, Sensei. It's a... Uh, Sensei. Uh, what's the name of the show? It's on uh, Netflix, and it's a novella, and it's about this girl who gets cocaine put in her boobs. Yeah. And she oh. gets a boob job. Yeah. Uh, and uh, it's, it's one of my- cocaine boobs. <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, Based it? on 37 true stories. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Savannah, thank you for that coming week. in. And Thanks allowing, for having me. And, and allowing uh, Henry to interview you. That was great. That awesome. was amazing. If, if people want to follow you, see your videos, uh, see what you got, what do they got to do? They can go to the Real Radio website. I have Savannah Swamp Girl blog. I have Savannah Bone, B-O-A-N. Uh, Savannah like Georgia Instagram Twitter Facebook you can see all my videos and all the fun stuff we always do together very good <laughs> always always great to see you and then you'll be back mm. in Key West on Friday right I'll be back in Key West tomorrow okay very good all right listen hey when we come back it's your chance to win some stuff it's the triple R segment at nine we